Sup YouTube, this is Drew from Not Too Nerdy. We're here with the Mass Effect 3 demo, finally. So uh, Mass Effect 3 is coming out um, basically March 6th of next month. Um, it's done by Bioware. It's an action RPG, uh, third-person shooter, hybrid, and it's going to be uh, published by Electronic Arts. So let's not waste any more time. Let's get into it. So I will be doing the review for Mass Effect 3 coming up in March. I'm really anticipating the game. Um, not gonna mess with this right now. I believe they do have a separate multiplayer demo that you can't play, but I'm gonna focus on the um, single player demo for now. Alright, so. This is what I was talking about. If you guys watch my um, anticipated games, um, they have three different modes. Action mode is kind of uh, straight up. If you want to play like action game, third person shooter. Role playing is traditional Mass Effect experience and stories. If you you don't want the um, combat to be as difficult, so I, I think this is a really good way to do difficulties rather than your your regular easy, medium, hard, you know, crap that most games do. And I'm of course gonna play traditional because I love Mass Effect. And I'm, I'm going to stick with John Shepard. Alright. And, and I always go to default. I'm definitely going to do uh, Vanguard. Vanguards are freaking awesome. I always play as a Vanguard. I'm just going to do Earthborn. Be a war hero. Look like Ashley. All right. So uh, I will see what my save does from uh, Mass Effect Two. How it carries over, but I just pick some default crap for now. How bad is it? Bad. We just lost contact with two of our deep space outposts. There's something massive on long-range scanners. Is this what Shepard warned us about? I'd stake my life on it. How long do we have? Not long. I sent word. The fleets are mobilizing. God help us all. <laughs> All right, so the Reapers are coming to Earth, but Shepard's got to stop them. This game probably has one of the best stories this generation, definitely. I mean, the first one had a great story. The um, action in it wasn't as good as, you know, something like Gears of War. And the second one really picked up the action. A lot of people said there wasn't enough RPG mechanics. I thought it was the right balance. But maybe the third one will find that perfect balance that people are looking for. Commander, you're not supposed to call me that anymore, James. Not supposed to salute you either. We gotta go. So it's Freddie Prince Jr., if you guys didn't know. Sounds important. What's going on? Couldn't say. Just told me they needed you. Now. You got this guy. Requiem of Dream guy. <laughs> Maybe a little soft around the edges. How are you holding up since being relieved from duty? It's not so bad once you get used to the hot food and soft beds. We'll get it sorted out. What's going on? Why is everyone in such a hurry? Admiral Hackett's mobilizing the fleets. I'm guessing words made it to the game looks command. gorgeous, especially cutscenes, man. The Reapers? We don't know. Not for certain. What else could it be? If I knew that. I'm certain it's the Reapers. It's the Reapers. And we're not ready for them. 
Not by a long shot. Tell that to the defense committee. <laughs> Unless we're planning to talk. I mean, compare this to Kingdoms of Amalur, it's like night and day, man. That's the one thing that game doesn't have. We've all reviewed your report, seen the data you've collected. But it's all just theory to us. You've been there, in the trenches, fighting them. You know what they're capable of. Is that why they grounded me? Took away my ship? You know that's not true. The shit you've done, any other soldier would have been tried, court-martialed, and discharged. <laughs> it's your knowledge of the Reapers that kept that from happening. Yeah, that's right. That's that's my badass. Good word. Yeah, I trust you, Shepard. And so does the committee. I'm just a soldier, Anderson. I'm no politician. I don't need you to be either. I just need you to do whatever the hell it takes to help us stop the Reapers. They're expecting you to, Admiral. Uh, everyone got them, them new iPad 4s. <laughs> Good luck in there, Shepard. Them iPad 2144s. <laughs> Anderson. Shepard. Kate, how'd it go in there, baby? Okay, I think. Hard to know. I'm just waiting for orders now. Admiral. Come on. You know the commander? I used to. Admiral Anderson, Shepard. What's the situation? We were hoping you would tell us. The reports coming in are unlike anything we've seen. Whole colonies have gone dark. We've lost contact with everything beyond the Soul Relay. Whatever this is, it's incomprehensibly powerful. You brought me here to confirm what you already know. Yep. The Reapers are here. Uh, clean up the mess. Then, how do we stop them? Stop them? This isn't about strategy or tactics. This is about survival. That's right. The Reapers are more advanced than we are. More powerful, more intelligent. They don't fear us. And they'll never take pity on us. But, there must be some way. Survive on any cost. Each of us has to be willing to die to save humanity. Anything less, and they've already won. That's it? That's our plan? Admiral, we've lost contact with Luna Base. The moon? It couldn't be that close already. How'd they get past our defenses? Sir, UK headquarters has a visual. Oh shit. Why haven't we heard from Admiral Hackett? What do we do? The only thing we can. We fight or we die. That's right. We should get to the Normandy. Oh shit! Damn. Oh, this game is gonna be awesome. Can't wait. Shepard! Shepard! Come on, get up. 
Oh shit! I love the guns. Got them space guns. Major Alanko, is that you? What's your status? Dead. I can't raise the normal. You'll have the contact. We'll meet you at the lab. Oh shit. <laughs> feels like Mass Effect. Got that weird, like, <laughs> that weird. It's so weird, but uh, that's the Mass Effect, man. Take a running jump. It's farther than it looks. Woo! Good. I'm glad they didn't put a jump button. Come on, let's go. Let's go. All right. Major, you read me. I'm patching in Shepard. We're almost to the Normandy. I've got Lieutenant Vega with you. We're taking heavy fire. We're about five minutes out. Husks! Take them out! Shoot them! You haven't forgot how to shoot them. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> All right, where the hell do you go? Uh. The new melee is pretty awesome. Oh shit. Damn. I got no ammo. I won't be responsible. I understand how you feel. It's hard enough fighting a war, but it's worse knowing no matter how hard you try, you can't save them all. Exactly. I get so fast. I thought we'd have more time. We knew they were coming. And they still just cut through our defenses. We need to go to the Citadel, talk to the Council. The Citadel? The fight's here. It'll be everywhere soon enough. You said it yourself. <sighs> the Reapers will destroy everything if we don't stop them. The Council has to help us. <clears throat> you sure about that? No, but you were a Council Spectre. That has to count for something. 